Hey everyone, so let's take a look here from what's the tea. Let's see what's going on here at the current moment. What's going on here in the collective that we need to be aware of? Hmm. You know, there's always a hater in the mix. You know, but I feel like you're blocking someone. Someone didn't want to, doesn't want to see you happy. Um, they may have something against your partnership. Some of you could be getting ready to go into a union or already in a union. And it looks like somebody here doesn't like the fact that, you know, you're, you're happy that you're getting married, that you are meeting someone. You know, this could be a friend, family member, a former lover of you or your person. But I see someone being blocked on social media here from seeing maybe even the photos of what's going on in your life you got stalker yeah but somebody's still watching obsessively whoever this is they're going to be watching even though you have blocked them and my thing is if you're not happy for the collective you don't want to see them be with someone why are you watching it's as simple as you closing the blind here it's as simple as you closing the blind. It's as simple as you logging off. It's as simple as you not trying to go on their page or create fake accounts to see what's going on in their life. But someone doesn't get that because they are obsessed or they will be obsessed with watching you because they feed off of your energy. If they see you happy, it triggers them is what I feel. You know what I'm saying? They watch you and they see see what's going on in your life and it gives them they just wasting time so whoever this is that doesn't like what's going on in your life they're wasting their time um they they're stuck watching you watching you the time that they're spending watching you and worrying about who you're with and what you're doing they are not going anywhere with themselves this is a waste of time, whoever this is. Tell me more. Yep. Screenshots, getting evidence, proof. For what? Somebody is heavily watching someone. What is this? Head in the clouds. You know, this is making me feel like this is it's just an unhealthy... It's just an unhealthy um, person who spends a lot of time just getting information on you, worrying about who you're dealing with, what you guys are doing next. And then the fact that it's almost like they're not doing, are they working? Are they making any money? Because my thing is, oh, this is a love triangle situation. There we go. So this is a third party or something like that where somebody is watching the person that they're dealing with or they were dealing with be with someone else. Okay. This is someone who either... Wow. Yeah. I feel like a, this is a third party situation going wrong because somebody here is obsessing over who somebody is really with. Where are they going now? What are they doing together? Yeah. And then they come back around, kiss ass and apologize. This makes me feel like this is someone who gets upset that they are the third party, argue with the person. Why are you guys going out of town? Where y'all going? All of that. And then come back and apologize for being, for, for, for stalking. What is this? Carless, no car, repo, car issues. Someone could be having car issues. Or something's just not moving forward. Like someone just doesn't have the, the a way to just move on. You know what I'm saying? You know, whoever this is, they could be without a car right now. But it's like somebody's watching someone be with someone else. And it's almost like... It's, um, oh, it's making them reflect on what they had. Okay. So 
or someone could could definitely be dealing with multiple people here and it's almost it's like somebody here is reflecting on the connection that they had with someone maybe someone is being cut off from a third party situation and it looks like somebody here is trying to get away from this person someone could be a business owner with boss bitch someone could be stable this is giving me divine feminine energy doesn't have to be though because anyone could start a business you know but i feel like somebody here is um definitely chasing someone and somebody's running trying to get away from them but they're steady watching them move on and be with somebody else and you know i don't know yeah nightmares insomnia it is it's triggering somebody here okay so what else because this is nothing new once again in their head overthinking stressing over analyzing this could be somebody here who just they're trying they're trying to see if someone has moved on and they're unable to come forward because something going on with the car or distance or something like that so they're in their head overthinking a situation with someone <sighs> they are curious about you they want to know who you with what you're doing where this what are they doing with their own self look like somebody should be focused on a car yeah move in silence don't tell this person your business here i just want to know what they want creeping is coming out here girl fight they lost their chance bad reputation so um, mm -mm. this is somebody who has a bad reputation they may have ruined tried to ruin your reputation you don't want to deal with this person or the person that is coming into your life doesn't want to deal with this person because they always want to argue they always want to fight they want to continue being in somebody's life maybe to creep with them or whatever but someone feels like this is dead it's a missed opportunity it's over there's no need to even keep watching this person because they may have already chosen who they want to be with somebody is still digging for dirt trying to find a reason to start a fight someone could have caught an std from someone and now someone is threatened intimidated by the fact that somebody doesn't want them yeah not too bright low iq that's what's going on here there's someone who wants to argue even have a physical fight with someone they want to compete. They want to be able to come in. They have something that they want to say to possibly a king of wands. Or a king of wands has something that they want to say. Somebody turned their back on somebody here. And now someone is very upset. Somebody is angry about it. And someone could have given someone a, a STD or someone thinks that they got it from someone as well. And that could, man... I don't know who did what. Yeah, somebody gave somebody something with the Six of Pentacles. Yeah. And someone could have had to go seek some type of counsel, get some help here. But I also feel like someone is going, trying to go into a commitment or a union with someone. And they have somebody else here who is not letting it happen that way. Either, either they were you know contracted something from this person and this person just kind of moved on to be with someone else or they're the ones that gave it to someone and you know they were left or whatever i don't know what happened here but somebody's got a bad reputation and that being with caught a case is not good look at the ace of wands coming out here yep someone has been being very nasty sexually and I feel like somebody has something to say. So this is turning around now. This is flipping over. Okay, so somebody, let's flip it. Somebody could have been around here just spreading STDs or something like that. The multiple people with the Six of Pentacles here. Now somebody is threatened and bothered by it. So they could be wanting to confront this person, but they're being blocked. 
somebody blocked this person, kind of moved on to somebody else, you know, and now this person is in their head and they're overthinking, you know what I'm saying? Because they, they want to confront someone. They're watching this person, but this person is running from them because they know that this person has something to say to them. Now, I don't know why there's Carlos here or whatever this is that's going on, but I feel like, yeah, somebody's had to heal from, look at this. Somebody's had to heal from something that someone has done to them. Yeah. But I feel like this person is still wasting their time. You know, I understand that th if this is what somebody has done to you and you're reflecting on that, it's just, you know, go take care of yourself. Do what you need to do here, but just leave this person completely alone. Yeah, blocked. Just keep it, keep it blocked. Keep them, keep them away from you. I don't know which way this story goes for somebody, but you know, I'm I'm seeing it both ways. The sun card, and just be thankful that you can, that you got an opportunity to just kind of move on, move forward. But I feel like somebody's being blocked once something comes out. Like, yeah, how could you do that to somebody and then just move on as though nothing ever happened? So this is why somebody's. Somebody is stuck. Yeah, Queen of Cups. Someone could have found out about a Queen of Cups. That somebody, what's this, that somebody is um, moving on to to be with someone else. Here, what's this Queen of Cups? Someone could be pregnant, could have a child with someone. The Strength card. So there's a Queen of Cups that's just trying to hold back from saying something or hold back, you know, from really how they feel. But they kind of want, I feel like somebody wants to expose someone. Oh, wow. Wow. What's this curious about you? Death card. Yep, something's ending. Something is ending. And I feel like somebody is curious about, about somebody, what, what happened with them or what's going on with them or something like that. Something is ended. And three or four, yeah, it's ended in heartbreak. It ends in disappointment. It ends in a third party situation here where somebody is left trying to figure out why did you waste my time? What, what you know? What's up with this King of Wands? Ten of Pentacles. In reverse. They are releasing something. They are ending something. Something is ending here. Possibly around a family situation. Yeah. There's an ending here. And then this Queen of Cups is holding back from exposing something is what I feel. Tell me, what's this with the Sun card? Yep, five of um, five of Swords. Like someone could say something, someone could do something, but it's like an empty victory. You know what I'm saying? I feel like somebody betrayed someone already and walked off to be with someone else. In actuality, I feel like you know the one who wins is is the person who decides. You know what? I'm just going to take this L and keep it moving. Because this person is going to, yep, Queen of Wands. This person is going to do the same thing to the next person. And even if they don't, you know, like I just said in another reading, be happy that you're, you're able to get out. Now, I don't know, you know, what's going to be the consequences here. But I feel like... Um, Someone may realize that they were the other person, the other woman, other man. And not only that, I feel like, you know, someone could have given someone a bad reputation saying that they, they had STDs or something. Those could be accusations. It could have happened, but it could be an accusation that someone tried to ruin somebody's name. And it could have someone saying, you know what, I could, I could put you out there, but it's, it, it's, an empty victory for me. It's, it doesn't even make sense for me 
to do so because you know what you're going to still do the same thing with somebody else you know so i feel like somebody's just a beautiful liar out here five of pentacles with the knight of cups this is someone who leaves other people out could possibly be sick get people sick with the five of pentacles here you know and then they move on knight of cups that knight of cups That Knight of Cups is prepared to go make another offer somewhere else. Where is the Knight of Cups headed to? To lovers. Another choice. Some the two more naked people sleeping together. Yep. They this is someone who could eat, fall into temptation easily. They could have lots of sexual partners or something like that. Um, but they leave other people behind. I feel like, oh my god, I don't even want to go here. But let me go here. It's five of pentacles. I'll be trying to keep it PG. The hermit. Yep. This person here. Like to leave people alone and leave them out. You know what I'm saying? They they deal with them. Leave them out in the cold. And it's somebody here who's not having it. Someone wants to out someone. You know, someone feels blocked. Like, like somebody just discarded them. And they're not taking it too well. Yeah, because somebody got what they wanted. And then they just kind of move on to another cycle. Ace of Pentacles. Yep. They move on to the next shiniest thing. And the thing is, someone could be, you know. Mm, yeah, someone could. Maybe this is somebody who likes to attract you know, people with money or something, or they, they use their money to attract people. But with this right here, this don't look good. Ace of Wands caught a case with bad reputation. Somebody could have a bad reputation for having, for spreading something here. Yep. This is making me feel like somebody kind of wastes people time. They get in, they get out before someone finds out. Yep. Five of, five of Wands creating conflict competition and all of that making people think that they're gonna be with them and have a marriage and be happy together and then you know they're offering they're selling people a dream is what it looks like and then look at the four of the food then they go off into a new venture i see why somebody is upset but at the same time like i said all this stalking and watching and all of that it's time to move on from that somebody's wasting a lot of time watching this person i mean do what you need to do to protect yourself or you know take care of yourself if you but this is an empty victory to keep reflecting on this situation someone needs to go ahead and heal and and let go because one thing about it this person is going to continue to collaborate with other people they're going to continue to get into new partnerships you know what i'm saying and they're going to continue a cycle until until they can't do it anymore. Okay. So I'm going to leave it here guys. I, I really don't know. <laughs> this just went left. <sighs> but I see it. You know. I see what's going on. And it's really. It's really sad. I see both sides of the situation for some. You know. Alright guys. I'm going to leave it here. I will see you guys on the next one. Have a great day.